chest on my chest Be my lover, yeah. be my best friend I will wait on your border until you will let me in Hand on my head, chest on my chest To the sound of voices and of drums I will show you how the West was won so I'm heading to Republic of Ireland and I'm wanting to go to a beach called Murderhold Beach which is in Donegal. Now I'm being told that this beach is quite tricky to get to, which have to cross some private property. And I'm hearing mixed reports as to whether or not the farmer is going to give us access. Some people are saying that the farmer is very, very friendly. Other people are saying, no, the farmer will not let you cross his field. <clears throat> so, I don't know how this is going to pan out. I'm coming a long, long way to get here. I don't want to be driving all the, all the way out here just to be told, sorry, no, you can't use my field. Because that would mean having to find another location. And, you know, scouting out compositions and puts a wee bit of pressure on you, you know. But hopefully we'll, we'll come out and we'll be able to get, get into the field and into the beach, essentially. I've seen photos of the beach on, on, on tourist websites and things like that and it looks fantastic. It looks, I think it was voted in the top 10 of places to visit in Ireland on TripAdvisor or something like that. But who knows. And, and the flip side of this Donegal, so if I can't find or if I can't get to the beach, I'll, I've given myself a few hours to try and you know, maybe find somewhere else. But we'll see what happens. I really, really want to go to this beach, so I do, you know. Hopefully, even if if I can bump into the farmer, you know, and, and have a chat with him, and maybe charm him a little bit, you know, he, he maybe give us access. We'll see what happens. As I say, it is a long drive from Belfast to, to where we're going, you know. The weather reports wasn't great for today, but you know that's not necessarily a bad thing for photography. You know, sometimes bad weather in photography could be a good thing. You know, it could be more drama in the skies and stuff, you know. I just don't want grey overcast skies, but so far it's yeah, the sun's peeking through. But we'll see what happens. Fingers crossed, fingers and toes. And with any luck we'll get the murder hole beats and get a really good sunset. So uh, just a quick update. I've arrived at uh, the field that that private property that leads you to Murder Hole Beach. And there is a sign on the gate saying beware of bull. And there's also a sign saying no drone footage or, or things like that. But uh, I needed to have a bit of lunch anyway, so I decided to sit for a bit and, and, and wait. And the farmer arrived then in his van. So I thought it was a good opportunity to go out and have a chat with him. And uh, he seems like a really decent guy actually. And uh, I was chatting away to him and he gave me permission to go on to the beach and take some photos. And, uh, and he gave some reasons as to why he has been a wee bit, the last few months he has stopped permission. Um, I think it was more to do with summer months and they were getting inundated with tourists and there was a lot of rubbish and that being left everywhere. But uh, you can understand that really at the end of the day. And it is his land that we're crossing so we'll have to respect landowners' rights. So, but we'll press on. He's given me permission so we'll press on and, and see what we can do. <laughs> Chest on my chest Be my lover, yeah. be my best friend I will wait on your border until you will let me in This place is absolutely amazing I've never seen anything so beautiful in all my life it's, it's like stepping back in time to a Jurassic age. Waves are absolutely humongous. We've got this island that just seems to be floating there in the background, in the surf. 
what an amazing location. I think I'm real. I think this is my new favorite place in Ireland. I may be spending a lot of time up here. So many different compositions to try. You can look that way for the sunset. You can look that way for the sunrise. There's so many great compositions. Look at how far the tide just seems to creep in on you. Outstanding. Let me just let you see these these waves. Okay guys, I've hiked up here onto this ridge, as you can see, it's a pretty good view. Uh, the sun should drop behind that land in the distance there and maybe get the island and a nice bit of sea spray. If we're lucky, we'll get a good sunset. But there's still a good few hours daylight left, so I'm going to set my camera up, get my composition made and get a few hours, get a few hours kip in the great outdoors. No better place. So, fingers crossed, hopefully we get a good sunset.